Well, the residents of Lumberton, North Carolina, are very familiar with the damaging potential of floodwaters that come after these tropical systems. It's been only two years since Hurricane Matthew swept through the region, sending floodwaters into the neighborhoods. And here it is again. Many of the residents here have told me they feel like history is repeating itself. This time, however, they tried to get ahead of this storm. Last week, they came together, strangers with city officials, to create a man-made, a makeshift levee, if you will, in a certain part of town that they that they say is where the water swept in after Hurricane Matthew. In an effort to try to keep that from happening again, they created uh, that levee. However, on Sunday, it was compromised. We were there with the U.S. Coast Guard as we noticed that the water began seeping in, breaking part of that barrier. It did buy them time, however, an opportunity to evacuate some of these neighborhoods that were hardest hit by Matthew, get people to higher ground. However, officials fear that there are still many people who decided to stay in their homes, even though these water, these, uh, the water level continues to rise. Authorities say that they expect the uh, Lumber River to crest Sunday night into Monday, uh, possibly even reaching uh, record heights. In the meantime, authorities say that there is still one main levee that runs along that Lumber River that is still holding up and is still doing okay, doing the job that it's supposed to do. But officials say, and they fear, that if that gives out, then all bets are off. Paula Sandoval, CNN, Lumberton, North Carolina.